Hi, my name's Beth, I'm one of the keepers here at the carnivore section of the zoo and we're in the lion habitat this morning and we're going to put out some behavioural enrichment for them. Okay, so I'm just going to put um, some rhino dung out for them. Um, this is something that they really like to roll around in, they like to get the smell all over them. The thought behind it is that if you smell like the thing you want to eat, um, they don't smell you coming. Um, here I've got some cannon bone halves that I cut in half so that I'd have more things to hide around, um, get lions up and active and doing things. They are naturally quite sedentary animals so they sleep for around 18 to 20 hours a day um, so getting them to do things is really important. I'm going to put one of these up here. Behaviour enrichment is just anything that stimulates natural behaviours, so we can do this in a whole lot of different ways for lions. We do this a couple of times a day, so we do it in the morning after they've had breakfast, so they come out to something new, and then we do it again in the afternoon. And it's just really important to give them a whole lot of different um, things to stimulate their minds, um, keep them active and keep them curious and looking around for new things to do. This is squid juice. <laughs> lions haven't had this before, so I'm not sure what they will do with it. I'm just going to pour it around. You can make kind of like scent trails that they can follow or choose to ignore. They can rub around on that if they want to. So here at Auckland Zoo we have two male African lions, Malik and Zulu. They are nearly 17 years old, uh, which is getting quite old for lions. In the wild their life expectancy is around 8 to 10. So Zulu and Malik are part of the Australasian breeding program for African lions. So they moved to Arana Park in Christchurch where Malik sired some cubs to keep uh, genetic diversity between lions in New Zealand and be part of a pride situation which is uh, really enriching for their lives. And then from there they moved to Wellington Zoo and then back up to us at Auckland Zoo. Lions can eat a lot of food, they can eat around 15% of their body weight in one go, which is for these guys about 28 kilos. So Zulu weighs 191 kilos and Malik weighs 181 kilos. For a person my size, that would be about 11 and a half kilos of food in one go. I just love lions. They're my favorite um, animals to look after. They are really dynamic in their emotions. They let you know how they're feeling. The vocalisations that you hear around the zoo um, when they are calling is basically just Zulu and Malik saying this is where Zulu and Malik live, if there's any um, men around the vicinity they should run away and if there's any ladies they should come and visit. <laughs> Lions are really vulnerable to extinction in the wild. They have become extinct in 26 of the countries they were once present in around Africa. And this is mainly due to habitat loss because humans are encroaching on spaces that wild animals need to live. And they also lose out on the food that they need to hunt if they are a lion. Every time you visit our lions at Auckland Zoo, you're helping spread awareness for their wild cousins. Your visit also contributes to the Auckland Zoo Conservation Fund and the conservation projects we support worldwide.